Historically, it has been long known that the Vikings were the first Europeans to undertake the long journey to the Americas, landing in Canada somewhere around 1000 AD. According to a recent paper published in the journal Nature, the year 1021 was the precise year the Vikings landed in Canada, approximately 500 years before Christopher Columbus's arrival. But the Vikings did not stay for long in Canada. Why? That's what today's video is all about. We will be sharing with you why Vikings left Canada despite occupying a really great land. Thanks to new carbon dating findings, we were able to mark the 1000th anniversary of the Vikings' arrival on the northern coast of Newfoundland this year. Yet, to this day, no one knows for certain why they came, or why they left. Whatever occurred in Lanso Meadow, like the disappearance of the Mayans and the strange events that occurred in the Lost Colony in Roanoke in 1590, has remained buried at Lanso Meadow for all of history to discover. In recent years, investigations by cultural anthropologists, meteorologists, and historians appear to have pinpointed precisely what happened to the Viking settlement in Canada, an event that happened 471 years before Christopher Columbus set sail for the New World. After building eight quite durable wooden structures and taking a brief tour of the surrounding area, the Vikings appear to have simply packed their belongings and left. But why? Archaeological investigations on Lanso Meadow in the 1960s unearthed the ruins of eight turf-walled structures, three large homes, two small workshops, a forge, a shed, and a tiny sod structure. Most objects discovered at the site were iron boat rivets and floorboards from small boats, suggesting that boat manufacturing and maintenance were major activities. But the fact that the structures appear to have been abandoned after a brief period implied that the settlement was indeed abandoned. According to Dr. Kristoff, it was too cold, he said. If you think Oslo or Stockholm is cold in the dead of winter, try Newfoundland in the early 11th century. The Vikings got to northern Canada, kicked the tires, froze their keisters off, and hightailed it out of there. From that point, they confined their raids to temperate climates like Normandy and southern Italy. After a couple of months in Newfoundland, they realized that colonizing Canada would be a waste of time. Of course, not all historians agree with this unambiguous, though extreme, verdict. Viking supporters believe that such a perspective does the brave Norsemen a dishonor, but the reason why Vikings left Canada is still unclear. So, it does sound strange that Vikings left Canada due to the cold environment, but it is the view of many experts. Maybe they just went to Canada for valuables, but they could not find what they wanted in the first place, so they left. The true 100% reason for abandoning Canada is still unclear. So we will end our video here. If you have any thoughts, please let us know in the comments section. Like and subscribe to the Vikings Code channel because we will be providing you the authentic information regarding Vikings. Don't forget to hit the bell icon as well, and we'll see you in the next one.